my research project is looking at the relationship between the type of surgery received by early stage breast cancer patients and surgeon characteristics. So specifically right now I'm looking at surgeon volume. So for example, do high volume surgeons give different types of surgery for early stage breast cancer, um, in Alberta specifically, than low volume surgeons. So early stage breast cancer patients, um, most of them can receive either breast conserving surgery and then they follow up with radiation or they can receive mastectomy. And both have like uh, survival that is very similar and so most of the time they're both an option. Breast conserving surgery is preferred by patients through some studies. Um, like I said, both of them uh, could be prescribed to most patients, but different surgeon experience and different characteristics of the surgeon may lead to them performing one more often than the other. Like there are some cases where mastectomy is preferred or breast conserving surgery is preferred, but surgeon has a large influence on the patient, what the patient decides to do. In Alberta, the rate of mastectomy is very high compared to other provinces, and so we kind of want to know, you know, why this is. Previous research from our group has also found that stage two and three breast cancer patients, um, when they receive breast conserving surgery, are surviving longer, which according to clinical trial results, that shouldn't be happening. These stage two and three patients are receiving, the ones who are receiving mastectomy, um, aren't living as long, and yet the rate is very high in Alberta, we want to figure out why this is. Itaka and Marcy have been absolutely great through this entire process with the applications. They've been great right from the beginning with, the, with being in the program. Um, they both offer me great opportunities. Itaka is involved with so many different projects and international collaborations. He has weekly group meetings where we all get together and discuss and learn from each other. With Marcy, her being at Alberta Health Services, I'm exposed to the um, government side of things and so I'm involved with some some work with her over there and meeting with physicians and surgeons and other people in the in the government. Between the two of them I kind of have the educational side and I have the exposure to the government side and they've both been really great. Winning all three was a really big surprise and uh, it, it feels really, it feels really great. I mean, I couldn't have done it without Marcy and Yutaka's support and the School of Public Health being such a great atmosphere for my work.